This is a 2000 point city fight for rootstem.co.uk, exclusive to the website. Welcome guys, so the mission we're going to be playing today for this exclusive game is going to be from the City Fight book and it's going to be Thunder Run. Uh, Mills is going to be attacking with his Space Marines, his Lunar Wolves in the campaign and he's going to be going against a proper Gene Stealer Colt army. So there's no need for objectives, he just picks one to three units to be his Thunder Run units and he needs to get them off my short table edge. Then we're deploying a hammer and anvil style but only six inches away, which means that he's going to be able to hit me quite quickly. Uh, but the rest of his army is going to have to try and protect his Thunder Run units as they try and get off the board. So, right, I'm going to cut over uh, to my Gene Stealer Colt. So this is 2,000 points of Gene Stealer Colt. We've got a standard battalion of Gene Stealers, backed up by a battalion of Astra Militarum. Of course, I've just got the uh, Brood Brothers... Um, choice so they don't get any special benefits right so the warlord of course is going to be my patriarch he's going to have tenacious survivor and the icon ward will have the unique relic from chapter proof 2017 uh, i've also got a magus that's filling up my hq slots they're backed up by 15 gene stealers which are now increased in points are quite expensive now which i do agree with i think 10 points a model was too cheap for them a unit of 17 hybrids Two units of ten near fights, one with grenade launcher and Weber, and the other unit with two flamers. They're also backed up by 16 standard near fights with two mining lasers and two grenade launchers. And I've got a rock grinder. Yay for the rock grinder that dies every game. Backing those guys up, we have the Astra Militarum section. We've got two captains. I've actually got a commissar as well, which I completely forgot to get out, but I'll get them out in a second. A uh, tarantula sentry gun. Three units of standard infantry, two plasmas, one grenade launcher and three heavy bolters. A unit of veteran infantry with three plasma guns. They're going to be going in this chimera. It does have a heavy bolter on the front, but it has snapped off. And then we've got rocket launcher team as well, as well as backing it up with a manticore and a Lehman Russ executioner. First time for this particular unit, so it should technically die. I'll just get the commissar out for that unit. That's, that's it. Uh, quite a simple one. And I'm going to have to try and stop Mills from getting past me. Mills is back on the channel. Since it's his campaign, it would be a bit weird to have somebody else there. Well, you could, uh, you could do it. I could, but it would be a bit odd. People might think it's more entertaining. That's true. If you suddenly start changing your face. I'll start superimposing Granger's what face What I'll start me. doing is wearing, like, Deadpool mask. Yeah, that's a good Hugh idea. Jackman. Hugh Jackman. We'll put Mills Stan a Hugh... Lee. As Just long as I can staple it to your face, that's fine. It's a bit worth it. <laughs> yeah, right. What we're rocking today then, good sir. Majority of this is painted, it's quite nice. We have a battalion. Yep. Rocking two HQs. Yep. Me, Gravis Captain. My, yep. My so called chapter master, but I'm not paying the points for him. No, no, no. Um, a standard captain. Yep. Who will have the Teeth of Terror. Yep. The Loken model. We have four troops of four intercessor units. Two have sergeants with power swords. Yep. They all have normal bolt rifles. Yep. Um, we then have six elite choices. Vanguard squad. Yep. Uh, we have three power swords and a relic blade on the sergeant. Yep. Uh, that twice. <laughs> we then have two squads of terminators. Yep. Cataphract uh, terminators. Yep. Um, both squads have a plasma blast gun. Yep. Yep. The rules don't say you can have them, but these it's are for a narrative heresy. game, so, so we I are have still paid it. the points for them, yep. but. One in on five. Yep. One squad's arm with chain fists yep. and one power fist. One squad's arm with power fists and one chain fist. Yep. Um, three man squad are aggressors. Yep. With flamestone gauntlets. Mm -hmm. We have two Leviathan siege dreadnoughts with a uh, storm cannon array. Yep. Two heavy flamers. Yep. And siege drill with melter gun. That's yeah. That's pretty decent. That. And then we have a relic contemptor. With two close combat weapons and yep. two plasma blast guns in his arms. Yeah. So that's his six elite choices. Two of support. We know their class is relic units, but again, narrative game. 
uh, which is why we're allowing the plasma blast guns in the cataphract terminator units as well right that's a pretty decent army now which ones are going to be your thunder run units good sir i'm i'm gonna have to pick the two I'm, leviathans as two of them is right. it one do it I says one three? to three now i don't know whether or not you're supposed to tell me actually so we'll have a quick look at that so that's the ruling. After choosing the army, attacker must select one to three of their units to be Thunder Run units. These units will attempt to, to advance down the city thoroughfare. Thunder Run units cannot move into ruins or sector mechanical structures for any reason. So he has got to pick three of them. And I'm guessing, like he says, the two Leviathans with their magnificent move of eight. Do I have to pick three? Well, one to three. Right, so I'm just going to stick with them two because this mission is going to be incredibly hard seeing as yeah. they can't benefit from any sort of cover. Any cover. Yep. But they have the four of the invulnerable save. And they are going to be able to be obscured, so if I'm looking at them through something else, it's still yeah. going to be a minus one to hit them. But what I mean is, if they can't benefit through cover, you're going yeah. to eventually figure out which ones it is anyway. That's true. So I'm just going to stick yep. with them two. So them two are going to be his Thunder Run units. The rest of the army can be in reserve if he wants it to be, but if any units are in reserve, you have to roll for the reserve rolls. Uh, in this, and it's a three plus for ter three plus for the units to come on. Which will be quite interesting. Since I'm running Gene Steeler Colt and half my arm is not going to be on the table. Right, let's get set up, we'll get deployed, and we'll take you straight to it. So we've set up, Mills' is, uh, two front of run units are back here, he's got quite a lot of intercessors moving forward and some veterans at the lower ground, they're going to be coming across, lots of guardsmen, lots of guys that can go up, squish, Manticore of course back here, we've got a Lehman Russ back here as well, and a unit of veterans in the Chimera, heavy support squad is going against some more Primaris, and of course these guys down here majority of stuff i will be honest is probably going to be obscured it's got these guys guys with flamestone gauntlets they're going to be harsh because they're assault weapons as well them aren't they yes so he's a raid against a vast array of men his two units of terminators are in reserve my units are also in reserve and in the city fight game reserves you roll a d6 for on turn two on a three plus turn two and three on a three plus they turn up so, back to the old school rules of having reserves come in, on a turn four they are automatically on the table. So I cannot rely on the Gene Stealers to try and hold this guy up. I've got to rely on them on turn two or three to be able to come in. Bearing in mind though that Gene Stealer Colt does assign, you do assign characters to the squads. Right, I've rolled the dice, I've got a four, meaning that Mills is going first. So let's get straight on with Mills' movement phase. Mills has run forward, his uh, Thunder Run units are both running down here. God, the white is actually nice and glary. And uh, he's got both veteran squads have run forward. They're obscured, I can't see them. Um, it does mean I could possibly charge them if I wanted to try. Well, whether or not I'm going to try is going to be another question. Before we uh, carry on, yeah. do you have the sheet for the development? Uh, now, uh, Mills has upgraded himself. He has taken the formations from the campaign book. Yeah. So he's got the Primaris formation. Uh, I've forgotten what it's called. I think it's something Crusader Veterans or something Some of that nature. Yeah. 
both of his um, intercessor units with the power swords in there. He's upgraded Which, them. These two here. Yep. These two are upgraded to veterans. So they're going to be on extra attack apiece plus one leadership. Yeah. And allowing them as well to be able to take the uh, the veteran abilities. And he's also taken for his warlord the warlord trait from that particular sect. I've forgotten what it's called. Grey shield. Grey shield, where he's basically served with different units. So that means he can pick a different ta chapter tactic. He's picked Raven Guard. So he can pick Raven Guard and he's got his White Scars one, both acting in the same turn, but it does mean that in the first turn of a game, it's gonna be a whopping minus two to try and shoot a lot of his actual units that are obscured. And if they're not obscured, it's still a minus one. Hopefully. This is gonna be uh, quite interesting. Right then, so what are you shooting at first? Uh, this five man intercessor squad. Yeah. I'll be firing into your heavy weapon team. Needing freeze. Good. Just one. Just one. With a minus one. With a, a minus one, but it's a plus two for hard cover. So, and it wasn't a minus one tip because the figures actually have to be obscured. Oh, no. So, no, no, it's not that. It's just I rolled three twos. And I got a four, which is actually a save because I got a plus two minus one. Yep. So it's saved. Second squad. Yep. With these into them. Into the same unit again. He's not within 15. We've already had a measure. Three hit. Three hit. No minuses again because they're not obscured. And one wound. And it saves. Oh, mm, don't think there's going to be a lot of casualties from shooting in this game. Right, so Contempt is going to shoot. He does have line of sight to these. They are not obscured, so it isn't a minus one. All hit. And two wounds. And I'll be honest, I'm not in cover, so two of these are going to die. So these primaries are now going to open fire. Again, there's a clear line of sight between peeps, so there's no obscurity. It is quite hard to become obscured. I think smaller units might be better in this. So you need him freeze. And he is within rapid fire range. Need to freeze again. Uh, yeah, that's a wound. So you've got five. So five wounds one. with a minus one. And all five of them go down because I am not in cover. So these guys now are going to fire off into that infantry squad because he's not covered. And unfortunately, he's not obscured. Go on then, sir. Ooh, uh, you're not within six inches of any captains. No, no. Captains are with these yeah. down here. Need to freeze. Two. Two. Need to force to save. Save both. So plus in two for your city fight is, is becoming quite handy for guard. But it's whether or not I'm going to be able to hit him with some shots. Uh, that is it, because everything else has run. Everything else has run. So that is the end of Mills' turn one. So we're going to be going into the Guard Steelers uh, turn one now. So to begin with, I'm going to order this unit to first rank fire, second rank fire. They're going to fire down into these Primaris Marines. They're not obscured, but they have got the Raven Guard tactic, which means that I've got to minus one to hit. So I'm going to need fives. I'm not overcharging the plasma gun. I wish I had done. <laughs> not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. So these need fives, got one. The plasma gun needed three, and the heavy bolter needed three. So we've got one, which is plus two to your save, meaning it's a two plus, and one, which is plus two, minus one. So it's going to be plus one. So both of them are two pluses. Oh, you didn't have a charge, so it makes no difference nope, either, does doesn't it? Make, nope, doesn't make any difference. So it takes a wound from takes one. takes one wound from one, and then six inch range is going to be to there. They're going to do exactly the same thing, but not everybody can see. So... It's mainly going to be the front rank, should have done some movement with these guys. It's mainly going to have a front rank. So this unit is plunging fire, because it is more than three inches above the opposite, opposite unit. There's a lot of rules to remember for this. And not one of them hit, because it's a minus one due to Raven Guard. You only hit with one last cannon shot, regardless. No, I didn't even hit, because it was only, yeah, I did regardless, but uh, it didn't even hit. Right, so he's going to command that squad to do exactly the same thing. 
and they're gonna pour fire into those as well. Dice again, I've already rolled for grenade and added it to the amount of last gun shots. Needing fives. Ooh. Roll into wound. Two wounds, and he's got two plus saves. Which normally with Mills is a bad sign. Oh, it's fine. He normally rolls a lot of ones, does Mills, when you tell him it's a two yeah. plus save. Now, if you give me Terminators with four up save. <laughs> yeah. Two flamers are gonna scorch the same unit. It's gonna be five automatic hits. Does nothing happen with flamers in six no. 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 Uh two wounds. And it's two up saves again. He loses a marine. So there's no more orders, that's why I've gone straight to those guys. And I think these guys are gonna rinse repeat and they're gonna fire into these. Guys firing into those over there. These guys need fives. That's a lot better. Fives again. Four wounds. Four wounds. This will be two marines dead with my two upstairs. With, with Mills' saving throws, he's, he's quite cracking. Taking a wound. He has taken a single wound. Right. So, the rocket launchers now. I do have to try and get rid of these units. So the lead Leviathan is going to be peppered with rockets, but he is obscured and it is a dreadnought, so it does benefit from the Raven Guard ruling. Meaning, I need sixes. And I got none. And I got no hits at all there. Ah oh, well, never mind. Going on to the Lehman Rust Battle Tank. I've already done the last cannon. We did that off camera. We just shot. It wounded a Marine, but it didn't kill him. And then the plasma is going to open fire. Everything is going to open fire at those guys. So it's going to be 3D3 plasma gun shots. I only moved half, so the turret gets to fire twice. So that's going to be 2D6 plasma guns. And I am not overcharging because on a 1 to 3, I will suffer a mortal wound. <laughs> Is it one to three? Because it's minus two. Oh, is it? <laughs> Certainly one to three ah, to on. suffer a mortal wound. No, I'm good, thanks. Okay. So the red dice will be for the D6s. So that's going to be five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven shots. Shots coming in, needing sixes. I've got three hits. Now, if I would have followed Mills' advice, that would have been one, two, three, four, six mortal wounds. The vehicle would have been half dead. Yeah, but so. it would have been worth it, because you know these three, these three are kill. This kill is true, this is true, but, but he gets a plus two, and it's a minus three. So in actual fact, it's only, it's only, this is only really a minus one, so it's 50-50 chance of Mills saving. Needing freeze, all three wounds, and he needs a four up to save. But this is what I'm saying, this is a shooter. Sorry, just to repeat, by the looks of it, it didn't record that. So I fired this guy into these. Into who? Uh, this one. unit, the one with the wound on. Yeah. And he needs his fourth to save, and he's failed two. I only got two hits, I did need sixes to hit. So he did fail two, so I failed the marine, but the other one is still alive. The casualty rate so far is not impressive. Now, I've got a chimera down here. Can he see? Yeah, so you can see those guys. And they are not obscured from him. So he's going to pour some heavy bolter and multi laser fire into them. He has stood still. Multi laser will be in red. Still needing fives, sixes actually. So two hits. Needs threes on both of these. Two threes. Because of his plus two, he needs twos on both. Fuck oh, hell. man. Another one. So Mills has lost another out marine to that. Yeah, uh, no, out of that squad there. That's the only one that they can see. And then the Manticore. He's going to open up. He's going to open up against the lead Leviathan. He's going to need six to hit. But it's 2d6 shots. And this is where I command point the two. To a one. Well done. <laughs> so that's seven shots. Sixes. It's strength ten. And I didn't get one. I did not get a single six. That is not a great turn of shooting. Oh, forgotten. I've still got this guy, actually. So, heavy seismic cannon. It is in range in them. Actually, no, because I can see him without it being obscured. So, it's going to be fives. One hit. It's a strength of four, so I need fours. It's wounded. It's a minus one, but he saves it. It is two damage, and then there's a heavy stubber on there. Needing fives, and that did nothing as well. So, I've had a very successful turn there. Very successful. I've lost three Marines. <laughs> He's lost three marines. Six wounds. And that? to be honest, I only lost it's next turn. It's it's when we come to turn two and we roll for reserves. That's when it's gonna be to see that's gonna be crunch time. Right. So we're gonna go now go into Mills' turn two. 
he's going to advance a bit more. So Mills' units, they've stopped still, but the other units have ploughed forward. We did have a look at grappling hooks to see if it can be used in the assault phase, and it can't. Um, so other units have stood still, ready. He rolled for both his reserves, which he intended on coming down back behind the Leafman Russ, and both reserves went, no. <laughs> We're not helping out just yet. Wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> right then, good sir, what are you going to fire first? Uh, Garviel's bolt pistol yep. into the flamer oh uh, yeah in front. it's uh, yeah even with minus one it's a hit no. it doesn't do any wounds the uh, five bolt pistols from the veteran squad yeah into the same unit oh uh, yep yeah, it can be seen and not really obscured from all targets so just a straightforward freeze no ones Two Need wounds. Two wounds. And I've got my standard armour of five plus because I'm in the street. And I lose two. It's not looking good. For the Colt. The <coughs> five intercessors yep. are going to be shooting at the same unit as last turn. No problem. So again, three to hit due to the heavy bolter. He's not within six of his captain. So you've got three, three wounds. Minus one. But I've got a plus two, so I'm basically plusing one. Yeah. So that's two dead. That's three dead. Oh, that's a dramatic shift. In fact, one, two, three. I'm going to take the heavy weapon off. These uh, into the same rocket squad. Yep. All hit. Yeah. Even with obscured. They've been all obscured from there anyway. No, but there you go. All wounded. Ooh, five wounds. Four wounds, 50-50. Need fours. Damn it. So that'll be one heavy weapon team dead, and another one wounded. That's not good for heavy weapon teams. To these. So bolt pistols from those guys into them. No obscures. Can everyone see? They are up bottom floor. Ah, right. No. Oh, no. Sorry. These two, there's no actual windows in there. Right, so okay. So them two they wolf all, ones. They all hit. Yeah. Up. So, yeah. Basically do it like that. And three, three wounds. wounds. Three sixes. Fives and sixes to save, so save one, two go down. So Mills is checking, these three are uh, two, ones within rapid fire range, so firing up at the rocket launcher team. It is a minus. Yeah, because from that, obscured. yeah, they are obscured, so one that's wound. one it. No wounds. No wounds. Right, right this unit here. Well, there's them and my three dreads left in there. Yes, there is. So. The dread at back yeah. is going to use his storm cannon. Yep. Against these. Into them. Okay. I think he's has he got can you see that guy? I've got two dreads in front of him, so no. Yeah, yeah, I don't think he's gonna be able to so see. So he's gonna use his storm cannon into them. Yep. Ten. So yeah, ten shots. It's his minus two because it's heavy, and it's minus one for obscure, so it's many fours. And he gets to re-roll ones, because of captain. Good. I'll roll one, one, and <laughs> seven. No. Nope. So I've got three. <laughs> I roll them. Three. Two's to wound. Now Minus in... two. Two oh, damage. I get plus two. So I'm on fives. No. Takes down another three guardsmen from here. Where's your uh, commissar Ooh. or whatever for your leadership? Uh, commissar, I because I haven't got my figure. I've not proxied, he's not on, so I'm a bit knackered. What about he's him? a captain. He does not for leadership. He then. doesn't do anything for leadership. I'm gonna have to use command points. Well then, he's gonna yep. fire into them. So them four are gonna fire into here. Are you using a command point to give them rapid fire too? No, I'm just gonna use normal rapid fire. Okay. So have you included your pistol in that as well? No, because he's still on with a bolt. He's still on with a bolt rifle. Oh, right, okay. Reroll your ones, because you've got a captain near you. You are needing freeze, because they are not obscured. That was actually a hit. 
Well, that hit. Yeah, that was a hit, that uh, one that you just smacked with dice. There's only one miss, really. Right. Needing freeze. So you've got so four. four. Plus one. Yep, needing fours. Save two. So I'll lose two of these guys. So they're going to be so, dead as well. Now that they've not suffered as many, I'm going to fire the four plasma plasmas, plasmas yep. into them. No problem. He's not overcharging. Because there's no point. No needing guardsmen, is there? Two's to hit, re-rolling ones. Because he's a relic on Tempter. Needing twos. Now, it's a minus three, so I'm plusing two, so I'm minusing one, so I'm going to need sixes. Oh my god, Guardsman can stop Plasma with a six! Oh, that's alright, huh? So they've lost three as well. This might be bad for my morale phase. But he's still got one of the Contemptors, on one of the Leviathans left to shoot. Right, so the other Leviathan is doing the same as shooting at the squad at the top. Need fours. Oof. That's better. That's fucking loads better. That's two misses. That's a cock dice, yeah. And it still hits. That would have missed, though. That would have missed, yeah. That is a hell of a lot better. Two to wound. Seven. Minus two, plus two. Oh my god. I saved five. It's alright, it's two still enough. So two more have gone down. That's going to increase that morale to a five. In actual fact, I need to tap that down one. Because you didn't kill three, you killed two models. Oh, I shot at them instead. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, to be honest, I'll probably fail it anyway. But, uh, so they're now on a five. They're on two, they're on three. And I don't think you've got anything else to shoot. But I've got a funny feeling he's going to get charged. Though there's some combats going off on this turn. <laughs> I bet there is. Right, so we're back in. Uh, we're going into Mills' charge phase. His captain has charged my little flamer guy over here. The intercessors have gone into that guard squad. And the veterans, the vanguard over there, have gone into the uh, neophyte unit down that side. So which one are you picking first then, Craig? I'm going to go with intercessors first. Intercessors first. These are the veteran ones, so we get an extra attack apiece. So they've got three attacks per man, plus an extra one for the sergeant, and he's wielding a power sword. That's going to be nine. Nine no. Thirteen attacks in total. And then power sword in white. Yep. Ah, that's going to work. Not if I don't hit. Needs freeze. Can't re-roll any ones because he's not got anybody in proximity. It's that's a shame. rolled eight ones. Yeah. <laughs> so he's going against guard, so he just need freeze again. He's killed two with the power sword, which will probably be the heavy bolter. And then another four needing fives. No. So I've lost five in total. So one, two, three, four, five. So I'm left with a sergeant. Mills can consolidate no, no, that got, unit. You've got another guy. Oh, I've got another guy here as well. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. okay. You've got another guy there. So, so I've, another I've got four a models gone down. Move in, but so you that do will be get seven. To, uh... They are going to have a chance of fighting back. Interrupting. Uh, I don't see much point. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Uh, no. Uh, I've got 10 command points. Yeah, go on then. I'm going to interrupt with these guys. Yep. So, I've just used two command points. I have just gone with those guys there. Done two wounds and Mills saved them both. So, I'm guessing Mills is now going to punish me and just annihilate that particular unit. These are the power swords. Yep. So, have got two attacks apiece. You need freeze. And this. And then he needs freeze again to kill. So five dead. Five dead. Christ. The Teeth of Terror yep. has D3 extra attacks. Uh, teeth of Terror's on this guy here. Oh, it is. It's just a Relic I Blade. Yeah. Uh, relic Blade is three attacks. Three plus. attacks. And it's plus two with lots and lots of, yeah, so that'll be one hit. One needs, dead. Yeah, one dead. So that's six dead in total. And then I have three chainsword. Which will be an extra attack apiece. Oh no, uh, it's one, two. Two chainsword yeah. plus one for. Yeah. Just one armor save. Just one standard armor save. And that's a fail, so I've lost seven. 
men. Now <laughs> that unit there. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I've got one guy left. These guys have rolled for a cold ambush. I've got them in. The Gene Steelers, unfortunately, are still in reserve. They've got to move, uh, got to be 12 inches away, so I've set them up quite close to this Leviathan. Um, trying to shoot him. Shooting people in the back is no longer a thing, but uh, oh well. And then these had to deploy a 9 inch away and within 6 inch of a stable edge. Hopefully, if there's any survivors out of that unit, I'm going to be charging them. Right, so I'm going to fire first off the two mining lasers plus all the weapons into this leviathan so the two mining lasers to start with needing fives got one hit i need a three because it's strength nine got one wound it's a minus of three it's gonna have this four pin one no and it's d3 damage well not d6 as these only one and i'll come and point that <laughs> still a one so <laughs> god damn it I'm actually i was on eight so i'm now down to seven nope I actually am down to six because they command point something else as well. So running out of command points there. Right. Oh, I should have gone with my orders first, but for the matter, we'll, we'll do that right now. These guys are going to re-roll ones to hit, and they're going to try and open fire upon that contempt of dreadnought. Four last guns and a plasma. Two hits. No ones. No wounds. I did forget to fire all the rest. Oh, I'm going to shoot. I've got a psychic power to do. Ah! <laughs> you declared uh, all your shots. I know, I did. And I did declare all the shots and I ain't done them yet. I've just rushed through a little couple of little things. These guys shot, didn't do anything. These guys have shot against a contemptor, didn't do anything. These guys have fallen back, used an order to make them shoot. They shot at these, didn't do anything. And now my second order from that captain is going to be for these guys to reroll ones. We've got three plasma guns in rapid fire range. And they're going to do nothing. And possibly going to do nothing. Oh, but, they, uh, they will do nothing. They'll carry on. What they are going to overcharge, on. which is why I'm rolling three different colours. I get to reroll my ones and I need threes to hit. Because they're veterans. I need ah, twos, twos to wound. So I've got two wounds. Is a minus three but a plus two. So it's a minus one. And it did nothing! I've got the rest of the last guns to fire. So I fired the rest of the last guns into the Marines, managed to take down the one with one wound left. Then this guy opened fire into the Marines and did nothing still. God, I'm not doing anything at this moment. So Seismic Cannon is going to open fire plus a heavy stubber into the captain. So Seismic Cannon needing fives. I got one hit. It's a strength of eight and minus two. And it failed to wound. <laughs> Oh, I don't want to use another command point just yet. Heavy stubber, two hits, no wounds. I'm, I'm doing well. I'm doing very, very well at this moment in time. <sighs> right, Rockets, with you moving, are you now obscured? Yeah, he is slightly. Right, two Rockets then into the lead Leviathan. And they both missed. Oh. Oh, yep, yeah, this automated weapon has to fire at them. Two hits. Two wounds. No cover, because you're out in the open at the moment. Oh, touching cover, aren't I? You were touching that cover. Oh, right, okay, so... Right, okay, then. So it's, plus, it's only a plus. It's minus one. <sighs> Fact, I'd save one anyway. save one that. anyway on that. Right, the Lehman Rust, then, is just going to open fire with everything into that. Lehman Rust shooting into these guys. He is overcharging. Of course, same again. So that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve plasma shots. Twelve plasmas needing fours. I got three mortal wounds on myself. You got more. It's one to three, you said. No, no, one to three because of the oh, minuses. No, minus two, There's no uh, minus this time, so that's why I'm doing it. Two's to wound. That's four wounds. Minus. Minus three. three. 
plus two. Is he touching cover? Loses two, two guys. Kills two. So it's got to be. Uh, it's got to be aim. Uh, two gone down. Boom. I'm not doing that well. I'm not doing. Not taking off enough casualties. The rockets then into the furthest Leviathan because he's already wounded. 2d6 shots, that's 7. 7 shots, minus him 1 because he's obscured. Still not bad. 4 hits. Freeze to wound, 2 wounds, it's only d3 damage though. It's a minus of 2 but he does have his 4 fin bone. Yeah, roll that one again, that's cocked. So both get through. Four damage, in it? Two, it's two, D3, is it? which is five damage in total. And these start off on 16, don't they? No, 14. 14, right. And they suffered one wound from that. Fights have suffered six wounds in total. Right, let's get on with some charging then. Let's <laughs> see. I might actually have that Lehman Rust battle tank charging, just because it's funny. I don't think it should. <laughs> right, um. charges. Okay, so we're starting first with a Goliath Rock Grinder. Extra D3 attacks, an extra two. So I've got eight attacks in total with that. This is the first time it's ever got in. It needs fives. It's three. got three hits. It needs twos. Two wounds. It's a minus of two and it's D3 damage. One so save one for me, I The other Are one goes through. Are you wanting to reroll? No. No. D3 damage. Ah, I'm going to reroll that one. Two. So two wounds on the captain and it makes me down to five command points. My next attack, because Mills, are you interrupting? Um. I'm going to use crush them on that, so that means that it hits on twos rather than sixes in combat. Wow, that's one command point, but it's it's strength eight, and it's twos to hit, but there's no AP or anything about it. That's, uh, that's powerful, though, that. Twos to hit. <laughs> one. <laughs> twos to wound, and a standard armor save. Saved. Saved. It's, it's not bad. Chimera. Not bad. Chimera, three attacks, needing sixes. Hey, got a hit. Same amount of attacks as it did for a command point on that one. Yeah. And it does a wound. No minuses. Two. And it's saved on a four. So, so Mills gets to attack back with these units. So D3. So four. this guy. Garville. Just one. An extra one attack. All hit. Yep. Um, strength. I am strength five, I think. You're going to need fives to wound then, sir. I think it's strength five for the teeth of terror. Toughness is seven. It's got uh, ten wounds, got this armor and it ignores wounds on a six. Terrible. Yeah, plus one for teeth of terror. So yep. five to wound. One minus two, <laughs> two damage. So I need a six. No, two damage, need sixes to ignore. No, so it's down to eight. Chimera. These guys against the Chimera now. They're going to have to do a bit of consolidating in to get all of them in there. Am I within six inch of Loken or not? I'll check. We've just checked and he is. It didn't make no difference anyway except we rolled into twos. Yeah. <laughs> so ones become twos. Uh, fives on these and all. Yep. It? Toughness seven. So one armour. Yep. And it's failed. So I've actually lost a wound off a Chimera. And then I have... Uh, two power swords and three for relic blade against these power swords. Relic, relic blade in red. Yep. What's the strength of the relic blade? Uh, I don't know. Right. So he's going to need fives and sixes on his relic blade. Those don't do anything. That one, oh, does. No, that one does. That one does. Just check that, that for a cockage. Yep. Shame. Ah, yep, so that's two, two at with minus, minus three, three, and then one normal. at minus three as well. Oh, yeah, it's, it's power, power sword. sword isn't it? So the normal one saved, and the relics 
One's saved, one's gone through. Three, Ooh, wounds. three wounds with his relic blade. Takes that down to six. I believe that might be a bracket. So that's it for my turn two. Uh, we're now going to be going into Mills's turn three. So, Mills' units have trundled, trundled forward on their illustrious turn three. This guy here has broken out of combat, but he is White Scar's chapter tactic, so he can fall back and he can still shoot. Uh, these guys have broken off, of course, from the Chimera, and they've broken off from the Lehman Rust battle tank, which they're going to try and do a cheeky tactic later on and consolidate it into my units. Swines. Uh, the Terminators have finally made their arrival known. They have gone, hello. And, hello! So, what do I do? Do I target these guys or do I target something else? I have a funny feeling this unit may disappear or disintegrate under a fuselage of fire that at this the, moment in time. That is the plan. So then, sir, what you, you haven't got no psychic phase, you've got no orders to do. What are you going to do first? No, first off, I will do my three aggressors into your Chimera. Cool. Because so we just rolled off camera, he's got 22 hits on this unit. Including his frag stone grenade launchers. So he needs three um, Five, fives to wound. Not Ooh, fantastic. Not fantastic. Four. Another there's another one there. Four. So four wounds. These guys do have power pits in combat though, so there may be a charge coming up at some point. And one wound on the Chimera. So against infantry squads are pretty good, but against tanks, not so much. So pistol firing. Three hits. Got three hits. No wounds. No wounds. <laughs> He's awesome. He's a what a guy. Doing, doing well. Doing In fact, well. I should have re-rolled the ones for the flagstone. Yeah, you should have done. But forgot. Oh, my. So my fault. <laughs> I have gone fast. Like me and my psychic phase. These into them again. Right. Five well, shots them now, into them. Five shots. Forgot there's two still alive. Yeah. The increase. Because I'm not obscured. Two. two wounds. Minus one but plus two, so I need fours. And that's another platform. That's gone down. Down to one. My chances of trying to annihilate these Leviathans is getting slimmer and slimmer by the minute. The three here yep. will be firing into him. And he is obscured from their angle. Yeah, but they are in rapid, rapid fire. So minus one to hit. Here we go, Neem Force. Not bad, not bad. Roll that one again. So you've got four. Plus one. <laughs> oh, two fail! The heavy weapon team goes down. Ooh, these guys they look like targeting. They will into him, into this squad. Oh, probs. So some will have a minus, won't they? Um, or does it just count for squad? We'll well, just count it, for squad it depends if the whole squad's obscured, which they're not. Which is why I said smaller units might be good in this. Oh, right, right. But great. these two on top can see, and he's going to be able to see, but these two guys here can't see him. So you might right. as well pour so their fire I'll into them, here. I'll put them two into the two. So them two... Yep. Will be theirs that goes into that other unit. So are you going to one on top or the one underneath? The one oh is the two squads there now? There was always two squads, but you targeted them separately. I've moved these so that all of them are now obscured, so both units are now obscured. Right. I will fire the squad at the top then, yep. because they have a plasma gun squad in. Well both of them do. He's still got a plasma gun down here as well. But that's got a heavy bolter and a plasma gun. That one's just got a plasma gun. I'll do the heavy bolter and plasma gun. Heavy bolter and plasma is the one so on the, top. The two red are into them. No probs. Uh, fours aren't red then, yep. threes aren't white. It's going to be four saves on the guys underneath and one save on the guardsmen. Red for the guardsmen, needing fours. So the guardsmen die and two of those guys over there die. These five are opening fire into and guessing Jean's into the Gene Stealers. Yeah. Needing threes, re rolling ones because Captain's near him. Death Dealer. Yeah, he would love to have a Death Dealer though, wouldn't he? <sighs> One. One hit. 
and doesn't save, so I have lost a guy. Did I fire though? From this oh, no, unit. no, I didn't. I didn't. Oh, fire Logan, on a six, I ignore it. He fell out of combat. Yep, again. <laughs> Same bloke. <laughs> he fell out of combat, didn't he? So he did, I so didn't. Logan cannot shoot. shoot so, but this plasma wielding dreadnought and these two dreadnoughts can. I will be firing. Yep. Um, from the first. The Byron? From the Contemptor, yep. I will be firing four plasma shots yep. into the Gene Steelers. Are you overcharging? No. Okay. Because they're only one wound, aren't they? They are, but I do ignore those wounds on a six because of the banner. That's fine. No problems. So needing twos, re rolling ones. All hit. Needs twos again. Fucking hell. <laughs> four ones. <laughs> These guys have got. They're still wearing the thermal suits from uh, going down mines, mate. It's. Uh, what's that? Plasma? Ah, we walk through lava, pal. It's fine. What a scumbag. <laughs> right, so this guy is now opening up with his storm cannon array into these. And then everything else he's got, melter gun and heavy flamers, is going into that. Mm, this is going to hurt. Right, so storm cannon array first. Needing freeze because it's a minus of one. Rerolling Re ones. ones. All hit. Oh, Jesus. He's going to need twos because it's strength seven versus a toughness of three. I am not getting a save at this angle. Minus two, two damage. Yes. For your six up. So you have eight. Potentially of 16 wounds. Right, so I'm going to roll eight dice first. Any sixes, I'll then roll another d6 to see if I get another six. Otherwise, they're just going to die. So I've got one six. So that's eight dead so far. That's eight dead. Well, no, because you've got your. That's what I'm saying. Ignore cover. My armor save will not save it. So that's oh, what I've done. Right. So we've just done the heavy flamers. He's managed to knock off another two wounds from the rock grinder. Now it's melter gun time. Okay, re roll ones for the captain. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> that's me all, my dreads rolling ones. Any, any heat based weapons do not seem to be affecting these guys at all, to be honest. Right. Second contemptor. Uh, the second Leviathan is going to do exactly the same. So he's going to put his storm cannon into these guys. Yep. And then the heavy flamers and a melter gun into that. Yep. Right then, sir. Have you got your storm cannon ready? I have now. Freeze to hit. Three rolling ones. Ah, I got twos though this time. Right, twos yep. to wound. Eight. Oh, eight again. Same again. Any sixes, I'll roll another dice to see if I can get the two. There's one. So I've lost eight so far, and I've still lost eight. Right, so that has left me down to one bloke. <laughs> 17, 16 men gone. And then his heavy flame has done another wound here, and then he's got his melter gun to go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's eight. <laughs> it's a good job. But, uh, but I'm not one. Hang on, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> Come on, Point Mills, you got four left. No. You need a free to wound it. No. He's, you know what? Everyone, Plasma and Melter for this turn, they have all missed. He doesn't deserve a chance to blow that up. <laughs> That's brilliant. What oh. an absolute scum. Now, thankfully, that banner makes him fearless. But, oh well. And these guys have not even opened up yet. And I think, because of that, the banner guy might be the closest. <laughs> Oh yeah, because the banner, the banner guy is a, a character. character, isn't he? Yeah, he's an icon warrior, he's a character. No. 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 <coughs> he's going to try and get as many shots as he can up into the guard squad. Right, so these two guys are opening fire on these, they're not within 12. The plasma blast gun, because you can't see anybody, is going to fire into the veterans. And then, and then the two, two of the storm bolts are going to fire into the, the tank, the manticore. These are against uh, the infantry. They're misses. Uh, yeah, because it's a minus skewered. one. I am obscured. And that's three Boom. wounds. I'll just roll these. One dead. One dead. The two blast gun shots into that squad. Yep. Two Both hits. No, 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 no obscures. Two wounds. Uh, it's minus three. Minus plus three, two. so I'm on five. Six, seven, eight. Sixes. So it'd be sixes. Yeah. Hey, hey, save one. 
<laughs> Who uh, would have thought it? <laughs> and then these into the yep. whirlwind. The manticore, my friend. Manticore. manticore. It is obscured, yep, so it would be forced to hit. Needing fives and sixes. Oh, you got two. Two. Two threes. One. So one gets through. Ooh. Right, now it's this turn. It's turn. They're going to fire over here. Because of where they're positioned, that obscures it. So it's going to be a minus one to hit. He's not over... Are you, sorry, excuse me. Are you overcharging the plasma? Ones and twos will cause you to die. Now. No, I'm not overcharging. No probs. And definitely a cock one there, mate. <laughs> I think it's a fifth. How does that cock I don't, like that? <laughs> I don't know. That's a hit, so I'll use that. <laughs> right, so that's a miss. Leaning fours. Not bad, that. The fails that. No. Nope. fails nope. were all normal shots. Uh, ones Fives, and you need fours on the red. Good. One. One. And, uh, and it's saved. Well, better than what it used to be back in the day when even that was no good to be able to cause any damage to a manticore. Yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, so, so. Shot, shot. Can take his pin counters off because he now can charge with everybody. Shot. They can't because they fell back. They've, yeah, they can't. That shot, the, he couldn't. They, they have. shot, them two shot. Actually, these haven't they shot. shot. Oh, yeah, they have. Yeah, they did. They have shot. They have shot. Right. Okay. Everybody's shot. Charging. So, we're going to go into the charge phase. Right, just to let you guys know, me and Mills have just charged the sentry gun. The sentry gun has just scored two direct hits on Overwatch. Two sixes. I've wounded, and then Mills is going to roll two bloody sixes for saves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. If we recorded it, you'd have just got a lot of high pitched squealing then, to be honest with you. And yeah, they're definitely in. So Mills is going to go first here, he's picking a unit, he's picking that unit there to go against the rock uh, drill unit, against the Goliath, because uh, it could potentially hurt him. Huh. Um, so how many attacks do you get there, sir? Is it four? It is four attacks and I am still on my full profile. Needing twos. So all hit. I am strength 16. Toughness seven. Eight. With Eight. a minus four and straight four damage. Straight four damage? Yep. <laughs> well, I haven't got the ability to save apart from ignoring wounds. So unless I roll a lot of sixes here, I think it's dead, Dave. Do I explode? No! <laughs> command point. Ah, damn it. No, I'm good. So is the only me that command points to try and... Go on, in fact, actually, explode. tell you what I will, because I've got four left. Nope! And it's still down, still dead, still been destroyed. The Leviathan can now consolidate three inches, which it must move towards this unit here. Or it'll be the, the, or uh, Chimera, Chimera, yeah, possibly Chimera, yeah. Chimera will be closer. He's just got to be careful with his move because he can't put it into terrain. Oh, can't, can I? No. So I'm going to have to go like that. Yep. But the, the Goliath Rock Grinder survived more than two turns. Woohoo! It's a victory. So the next up is the aggressors against the Chimera. Threes to hit. Is it minus one? Yep. Yeah, because the power fist to hit. Me pause. I think me Mills have just shattered his knee. That counts as a six. <laughs> yes! It is a six. It's because it's just touched all them lovely spiders. Held it up. Yeah. Uh freeze to wound. All of them. Ow. It's five, is it? Yep. That's going to hurt my Chimera. No sixes. So that's five D3 wounds. And he's eight left. Oh, it's gone. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Explode, you... No! <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> Chimera's gone. This turn is shaping up to be Mills' turn. Right, so over here. Explode all. It's gone. It didn't explode, unfortunately. I wanted it to. Uh, Mills managed to kill a couple of guys, put a couple of ones with a captain, but his primaries didn't really do anything, but they, definitely the Chimera's gone. These two Dreadnoughts made short work of the infantry squad they charged, and they of course made short work of the guy down there. His captain has moved up a little bit, if you can see him from there. And then now we're going to be doing this combat here. <coughs> so you've got the attacks, the red will be for the Chain Fist. 
and he needs fours. That ain't good, is it's it? It's not that good. Cracking. He does need threes to wound, though. Not good at all, that. One. Save on a six. No. D3 damage. Just one. One. So that puts that down now to nine. He's not done very well against that at I all. I he has stopped it from shooting. I'm going to say, try and fire you yeah. two Vanticore missiles next turn. He has stopped it from shooting. So I'm going to do my fights back. I'll do my morale, which I don't think there's going to be that much of it to do. <laughs> and then uh, it'll be my turn three. Okay. My Gene Stealer units have turned up. they got a five, so they've turned up and then moved five inch forward and he moved four inch forward trying to get towards some of these juicy tasty morsels i've cast mass hypnosis i called it the horror it's not <laughs> on this guy here to try and stop him from firing overwatch and giving him a minus one to his hit rolls these guys have fallen back but i'm going to give them the order to shoot they're going to try and take on the aggressors <clears throat> even though really i should be trying to take on that leviathan choices He's fallen back, can't do anything. This has fallen back, can't do anything. So I'm basically going to be chased by a unit of veterans all game now. Yep. Oh. <laughs> right, uh, I've got to go with them first because, of course, it's an order. So they're just going to be... Which one do I give it? For... No, sorry, first rank fire, second rank fire. So the volley of last gun fire hits, takes one out. I've got the plasma guns overcharging. Are you actually going for them? Or are you I am. Leviathan? No, nope, I'm going for them. Um, so one's dead. Three hits. Need threes. I got three wounds. It's a minus of three and two damage. I might be able to take them out here. Yep. Yes. You kill them, but I, you've lost a guy from doing it. I have lost a man with a plasma gun. Man with a plan. I think you went for the wrong unit, personally. Well, it just depends what I'm wanting this guy to do. But they've gone, so the threats down here are diminishing. But the Viathan is still a credible threat by itself. Right, this guy here is going to fire plasma gun, overcharging, into this Leviathan. And then this heavy bolt is going to fire into that Leviathan, and both of them have got plunging fire. Well, I, I right. bothered with him it is obscured, so minus in one, need fives, <laughs> two blurry uppies, so he's dead. Okay, another dice for the heavy bolter. This one needs fours. He's not obscured from there. Need a five and six. No, nothing. So in other words, a fire at Leviathans and lose another plasma gun. And these guys have already cast their psychic power, which I remembered this time. Smoted one of those guys there. And they're just going to open up. So the first five are in rapid fire. Everyone else is at longer range. And then two of the mining lasers. Need fives. Five wounds. And he saved them all. We sixes. So yeah, pretty much yeah, we sixes. So all of that luscious, yeah, it's all gone wrong, Dave. It's all gone wrong. I am getting mullered. Losing five of these to mines as well, proximity mines as they came in from uh, Overwatch. Well, I'd, sorry from the uh, yep. I was going to use the Augury scanner, but I checked it, and the only thing you can use Augury scanner on is an infantry unit. Yes, it is. Which I think is bad. It's... Otherwise, it would have been that Leviathan putting all, right. all them shots into it. Yeah, but that's probably why it's just infantry units then. But I'm saying that Devastator squad would be quite uh, devastating on those or oh, Hellblasters. Mm. Right. I'm going to kill when it's one it shot. You're only going to kill them. Right. So, charging then. Let's get some charges done and take it from there. So, we've done the Gene Stealer Mass. They've gone into three different units, trying to tie guys up. Although he can still fall back and charge. Uh, managed to kill three of those guys. Nothing on Leviathan and one wound on him. So, not well, done very you know, great. Put a wound on Leviathan. Oh, yeah. Put a wound on Leviathan. So, a wound on each big boy. Now it's against this. So, the Patriarch going in. Needs twos. If I roll six dice, odds are I'm going to get one one. <laughs> now his strength is six, so he's going to need fives. Any sixes though, are a minus of six with a straight three damage. So I do need. Oh, 
Right, so that's one normal, which will do D3, and then three strength sixes, which are the three a piece. The normal, is it still minus one? It's minus three. Still minus three? Yeah, yeah. It's, I, I get to re-roll as well. I forgot, I get to re-roll wounds. It still failed. <laughs> so the three for the straight three damage. Yep. in red. So one oh, three damage goes through. Oh, man. You know now, though. You're gonna, Man! You're going to cop for it with Siege Drill. Ah, uh, crap. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, reduced it down to five. I thought, I thought when I rolled them three sixes, and I thought, oh, 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 he's going down. He's going down, but he's not. But he is possibly down a bracket, which is always He is a down a bracket. He's going to be in your on threes. No problem. <laughs> right, um, and then we've got the captain. Attacking. Mills is captain in here. And him, because he's still in combat. Oh, yeah, he's still in combat. Oh, I forgot to fall him back. That's my own fault. So, captain over here. Sorry if the camera's wobbling. Two hits. He's going to need fives. He got one wound. Minus a three. Oh, he takes a wound off so, the Lorcan. Yeah. Wannabe. So, he's down to two. And then I get to pick a unit. I'm going to pick these. Pick that back in two hits. No wounds. There we go. Right. <laughs> I'll go with all mine then. Adam. Yes. So the. We're going with squad of intercessors first against that one bloke. Reds for sword. Yep. Again, using all the normal profile rather than veteran rules. Oh, I think we're doing that. It's freeze to hit. Uh, yeah, I'll just check in with a Loken on that one. He's too far away, really, on that one there. So, so yep, uh, he's dead. Two power swords. Yeah, he's dead. Right, so we're going to go with Veloviathan next, the one that's on uh, five wounds remaining. One fail. One fail. It's all wounded. I'm strength 16, so yeah. no matter yeah, what yeah, toughness yeah, yeah. you are, it's twos. Yep. Yeah. Right, so. Straight four damage. So one of them gets through, <laughs> you're dead. <laughs> oh, bastard! <laughs> Oh, tenacious survivor! What does that do? I ignore wounds on a six, it's my warlord chart. Oh, so you need to save So one. I need to save at least one, one six. No! <laughs> <laughs> yes, so you know all them times. Oh. Uh, Joe's like pain thing for yeah, Dark Hill, and yeah. he walked up to your wraith lord and you went, fuck yeah, off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's exactly what's just happened. Yeah. Yeah, he's walked up, he's scratched him, he's hurt him, he's pulled some pipes out, and then he's gone, piss off, will ya, and just mushed him. <coughs> and it's just one hit to the jaw. Three swings, one hit to the jaw. Yeah. That's, that's what will happen between oh. Horus and Sanguinus. Are you, con are you consolidating with this three inches towards might well. him? Might as well, gets me, yeah. gets me three yeah. inches further up. Yeah, yeah. Bastard. <laughs> Contemptor. Yep. Yeah. Are you rolling ones? Cause yeah, because you've got two fists. Uh, three ones. Three in ones. Oh, I lost three. Oh, Christ. Leviathan? Yep. All hit. Three. Ooh, one. And then there's the sergeant. Sergeant and his relic blade. And a power sword yeah. rolling there. Yeah. Need freeze. Rerolling one for Loken. Yep. So that's fail. And two is fail. So two. Two in ones. Another one down. So unfortunately we're not fearless anymore, so I have lost half. Yeah, I've lost five of these guys. That's not looking good. That's not looking good at all. I did expect your patriarch mothering that Leviathan. Oh, I did. <laughs> uh, which is why he went in. The patriarch went into that Leviathan to try and muller him. I can understand why you put stop the Overwatch on that that one. Yeah, because I needed the. And it it was a good tactic, but I did assume that that one would die from the patriarch. Yeah. Right, um, and then it's your captain. Oh, ah, yeah, yeah. Uh, D3. So, 
Okay, he's got six attacks in total, he's just rolled his extra two. Rerolling the ones. Oh Christ. Um, is he plus one or plus two? I can't remember. Plus two. So you've got four, we are minus two and two damage. So it's just in vulnerables. Oh! Four wounds. Six. Oh, is it only a. So five up for guard. So a little quick synopsis. I've lost another guy to morale. I've lost a lot of men. <laughs> just to everything. Uh, he's still going to be minusing one to hit, but he's kind of trapped. So he's going to have to kill these guys to get this Leviathan out. So I do need to try him. I need to hold him up for a couple more turns. And then the other Leviathan's just going to. His, his movement is reduced, though, because he is now. Is, it, is their movement reduced? It, movement is reduced down to six, but I get plus three foot roads. Plus so three I'm foot still, road, moving, so still nine. moving nine. So we're still moving quite quick. Right, go on then. Into Marines, turn four. So Mills has funded forward. We've got various different units coming up. The Terminators are not being hindered. The Leviathan is ploughing forward. He's just moving down those roads. The veterans are up trying to trying to annoy this Limanus battle tank. He's no longer pinned. Captain Loken has gone downhill and he's left. He's had to leave these guys in combat because of the way I put it round and the fact that he can't go through there. He's stuck and trapped. The captain, of course, is trying to make his way back and these guys look like they're trying to take on uh, this particular large unit. I'll be honest, if he takes out that Limanus battle tank and then gets around that corner, I can't stop him. Especially since there's going to be two Terminator squads possibly pounding the crap out of my Manticore, which is the only thing that can really hurt his Leviathans at this moment in time. Um, we are on turn four, so there's potential of another three turns left. But if he does wipe me out, it still doesn't necessarily, in the new rules, doesn't necessarily mean he's won the game. No. Right then, sir. Go on then. So, these four rapid firing into these. Yep. Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Need him freeze. And he needs freeze again. Not no. one. They're using rubber bullets. Yeah. These Rubbers. guys? Yep. Five of them. Now these have got plunging fire, so they're gonna have an extra minus two to it's gonna be minus two to this. So whatever cover I'm getting, I'm not really getting. On that one? Yeah, roll that one. Yep. Two still miss. How many did you roll then? Are you within 15? Should be. Right, so we've worked it, we've done it again. Uh, yeah, back two weren't in rapid fire. So you've got five with minus two. Five with minus two. So whatever cover I'm getting, I'm not getting. It's just my armor save, which in actual fact, I only save one. So I lose four of those guys. That's not a good thing. I don't, these aren't in rapid. No, but they are gonna have yeah. some line of sights there, but they are gonna be obscured. So it's gonna be a minus one to hit. One hit, one wound. one wound. Again, it's minus one, so I'm plusing one, so I need a four. There we go, saved. Surprisingly, the casualties have actually come from combat in this city fight. It's been very, very combat heavy. I don't think it's surprising with the plus two to your armor. And minus one to hit in most cases. Um, in most of my units, bar two intercessor squads, mm -hmm. they were built for combat. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Right, any shooting from these guys? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to put a uh, bolt pistol into that because I realise that that hit. is now closer. Oh, yeah, I might as well throw a crack. Yeah. Hit it. Uh, I believe you might have wounded. Guys, here we're going to rapid fire into the guardsman. Uh, no, I think you're more than six inches away from that captain there. Yeah, I didn't count it anyway. Two. Two. Plus Two saves, even four. One down. Mel are going and going from Leviathan going into Lehman Russ. Storm cannon into Lehman Russ. Yep. The two heavy flamers into the guard squad. Okay. So Mel the gun. He need, does need a free now. Yep. No, he's not got no captains near it. What's uh, this? A storm cannon. This is first lot of storm cannons because yeah, they yep. brought no more dice with me. So no five problem. hits. Five hits. Four hits. Uh, it's minus one as well, actually. I forgot. Wow. It's heavy. Yeah. Oh, Needing fours. fours yeah, it? yeah. Um, so. Hang on. So we check the footage. It got five hits. 
good thing about recording games. Go on then, sir. You're going to need fives. So you've got three, three of them. We're minus two and Oof. two damage. It's going to hurt. Right, okay, so three saves, needing fives. I didn't do one. This is not what's that, what Mills wanted. He wanted it to survive. <laughs> and it doesn't go boom. The Lehman Russ has gone. The first Terminator squad gone. into the Manticore. He's, did you, are you wanting to overcharge him? No. No. no there's, right. there's no point at this stage. I mean, no. they're going to kill him for no reason or... Yep. Ooh. Wider the mark shooting there. Not even obscured. Needing fives. Fours on the uh, other. Nope. So you've got three. Four. Four. Normal armor. And then I'm guessing you're going to rinse and repeat with them. Yep. So we might as well do it all together. So four normal armor so far. Same again. Dropping some dice. It's quite a lot of hits that time. Yeah, yeah. Oh, rest of hits, fine. And then needing fives and fours. Six. So you've got six so armor saves. So six armor saves. Six armor saves mean freeze. I lost one. So all the bolt rounds didn't really do anything to the Manticore. That is all the shooting. That's all I of the shooting done. Just have charges. Yep. So we'll cut away, we'll do some charging. And we'll let Mills crack on. So the captain in Gravis Armour is attacking first. He's got five attacks. Um, these guys have managed to make it all in here. They did lose a Terminator on the way in. And uh, he did lose a Marine, Primaris Marine, trying to charge the veteran squad. But uh, it's not looking good for my guys. Go on in, sir. I am going to use the Power Fist. All right, no the problem. The reason being is I get to re-roll them. Whereas I'm going to need force to wound with my sword. Okay. Let me know here. Ideal because right. third of all hit with sword, wouldn't it? Yeah, so you've hit with four. Oh, fucking hell. What are you rolling, rolling two for? It's freeze to hit. With oh, it is with it's minus one. I'm thinking yeah. he needs to So you roll two dice, it. roll another two dice, mate. So right, three. so you've got three of them. I'm thinking he needs four to it. I save saved two. two. So one goes down. Uh, the. Space Marine. So we're going to move on to some Terminators. These guys are going to attack the tank. These are against the tank, the reds for the chain fist. He's near fours. He holds his ones, he's near Loken. It's a good job. Oh, only two. We need threes though. So the chain fist burns through. I can't stop it. It causes another two points of damage, taking that down to six. Then he's got these attacks against the captain. Roll that one again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Three hits. Needing twos. All wounded. Yep. And the captain is dead. Four chain fists against the back of a tank now. Needing fours. Rerolling ones. Needing threes to bypass. Oof. So that's, that's a dead tank. Twelve wounds. And it doesn't explode. One point. Ugh, I ain't got none. Oh, got one left. Nope, use them all. Oh, right. Damn it. So Mills is now picking a unit. It's picking the uh, veterans. That's going to be a total, yep, three attacks for the Relic Blade, which will be in white. Uh, Loken is not near them. Is he not? Uh, I'll double check. Two in runs. One down. And then I get to pick a unit. So I'll pick the Gene Stealers. <laughs> and they, because they're the only things that's left. It's going to be six attacks against the Leviathan. Ooh, he all hit. Even sixes. Ooh, two wounds. Oh, two saves. And then the Leviathan can fight. Well, I've got Contemptor and all. Yep. I, I? I should have gone with that instead of uh, Vanguard. Oh, yeah. Reroll ones, you near a captain. Two hits. Oh yeah, three hits actually, because he is. Three wounds. And they're dead, Dave. So he actually gets to consolidate three inches as well, doesn't he? He does, mate, towards the nearest enemy unit, which is the unit up there. But I can't go through building. No, so effectively he can stay still. Well, I can move down the road towards him. Yeah. 
Well, you can shimmy that way, but you're probably best off trying to get off this way, to be honest. Probably, but all depends on turn length now. Yes, it does. That's what it's going to come down to. So, if we just look at this objectively. It's going to come down to this turn. It's if in my the game turn, ends. I can't hurt Mills' unit. I can probably move the heavy bolter to here, fire, but I can't kill him. Uh, what's the lower bracket for that one? Is it three? Yeah. So, the only thing I can really do is to try and get him down to three wounds. So, in my turn which is effectively what I'll do, because the rest of the battlefield does not matter. So they'll move to there, they'll try and reduce him down to three. So you have got a plasma gun in this squad. But I need to fall back to be able to shoot, oh, and, you and the commander's, the commander's dead, dead. So the only thing I've got left up there is a heavy bolter. So heavy bolter hits twice, it wounds once, but that's not enough to put it down. No, but if it goes so, on another yeah, turn... That's... So it saves. So in Mills's turn, well, the contemptor, this is what we're saying because yeah, yeah, it's yeah. getting to the point where it can move six inch plus three is nine. So he's going to get to there. And then he can run. Because he might as well. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to have to run on it. So Mills is going to roll an inch. Think good, is it? So, then it'll be my turn. So I which need... I'm not going to bother doing any things for it. But, at the end of my turn, we have to roll then to see who goes first. Now, Mills went first, so yep. he has to roll the dice. And on a 3+, plus, we have another turn. If we have another turn, Mills wins. If we don't have another turn, I win. We have another turn. Mills is the winner by getting one of his units off the board. I'll be honest with you, that looked like a whitewash. But with the object game being very objective-based, it got it to the wire there. Eh? Yeah, it wore, uh, even though you've not got much left. No. It was one of those where it was like, I don't think I'm going to win. Yeah. Yeah. It was very touch and go there, to be honest with you. And if it had not got off in that turn, it wouldn't have got off the next turn. <laughs> so, so, yes, he ended up being a six, effectively a six turn game. Even if it would have wiped me out, though, it wouldn't have, uh, it would have still won because of a game I length. Won. I won. Well, if, no. If no. I if I would have killed you altogether, the game ends. I think that's how it works, but I'm not sure. That's how I. Look uh, at it. That's how I look at it as well. If someone side gets wiped out, then back to me, the game ends immediately. But uh, but yeah, Mills there. Only just. Only just winning. Only just succeeding in this city fight game. If you haven't played city fight. I recommend it. It's quite cracking, actually. Yeah, it, it, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed that. I would advise reading some of them stratagems, though, and looking yeah. at them based on your army. Yeah, I think sewer rats might have been a good one for me. Maybe getting another unit in reserve and having some plasma guns pop up somewhere yeah. else rather than uh, it's like having save, them on table. Same with myself. I think I'd have probably, um, I'd have probably saved a command point and not only done proximity mines, but I think I'd have also shot your gene stealers as they appeared. Yeah. So yeah. I'd have got two lots of through lots of shooting at him. Yeah. Yeah, so even when them proximity mines, especially for larger units, they were really definitely, good then. Definitely large Managed units. to kill five. A third of my unit got killed on the way in by rolling sixes. Because he rolled have 15 that, dice. Have you seen that breaching gear? I haven't, no. Breaching gear means, um, so your, your guy here. Yeah. He wants to charge them. Yeah. You use one point for breaching gear. And before you make your, uh, after you've made your charge roll, if you fail it, you can automatically turn one of the two dices to sixes. Wow, that's pretty good. Yeah, so that means, is really good. So if you roll a seven, yeah, you can turn the other one into a six. Means that's you've got a twelve really inch quite charge. Cracking. I would have thought I would have done more here, but I think Mills managed to muller quite a lot of my units before the other units turned up from reserve. I needed mm. to try and get rid of some of your bigger stuff that yeah. could hurt me. It yeah. were tying them up. And the hidden deployment as well meant that I couldn't, he couldn't compensate for a lot of my stuff and I couldn't compensate for a lot of yours. I, I get, just because of how long we've been playing each other though, I did yeah. guess certain yeah, units. Certain I, guessed, units. I guessed your Lehman Russ would be down yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Manticore. Or we at Kaimiro. 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 Yeah. I knew that were your Manticore straight yeah. off. Yeah. And I guessed your heavy weapon team were on one of them and rest were going to be your normal standard bodies. Yeah. Minus you know, one's to hit though. They helped a new Raven Guard tactic to start with. I needed we'll to do that, that but, turn uh, one yeah, to yeah. make sure that Certain I had a chance get of killed. getting up board. Yes. But I, en I enjoyed that. It's, right. Uh, well, when was the last time we played a City Fight game? Oh, proper City Fight game. Years ago, mate. Fourth edition, was Years it? ago. Yeah, me Fourth, and you. No, fifth edition. Probably, yeah. I brought that book out. Oh, it did. did. Cities of Death. 
Well, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I was going to say please like, share, subscribe, but this is going to be exclusive to my website. So, thankfully, this is exclusive content. So, if you're watching this, fantastic. You've joined rootstem.co.uk and hopefully going to look forward to more exclusive videos. Don't forget as well that you still get access to all of my YouTube videos early compared to the rest of the world. Well, thanks for watching. See you next time.